1976, my two brothers and I purchased a company called Plastic Specialties Incorporated. I was 29 years old, working as an engineer with an MBA with a manufacturing background. We were able to purchase the company with a note. The company had, had uh, been in business for 10 years, but it had come down to about four employees and was going to close down. Over a period of time, we changed the name from Plastic Specialties Incorporated to PSI Urethanes so people would know what we did for a living. When we moved the company to Austin, we were in a small building, about 8,000 square feet. We knew from the beginning we couldn't compete with companies that uh, had a lot more capacity. We couldn't compete for those long, uh, commodity jobs with a lot of money, so we decided we had to find out what we could do uh, that would make us competitive. So we became specialists. We uh, decided that we could be flexible, differentiate ourselves from the competitors by offering things that they either didn't want to do or weren't capable of doing. A big example of that, and one of the things that uh, helped us grow a great deal, was that the big companies sold sheet material in four foot squares. Die cutters and rubber product distributors around the country bought these cut out pieces their customers needed and threw the rest in the trash. So we set up a way to make sheet material to custom sizes with movable molds. For instance, if a, co a company needed a 17 inch by 39 inch piece and needed a dozen of them, they could only get two out of a 48 by 48 and the rest went in the scrap we set up to be able to make exactly the sizes they wanted with no scrap. We also started doing a lot of custom roller recovering. Got a customer with a machine, has got six rollers on it, he needs them recovered, he wants them blue, and it's not an off-the-shelf item. We decided that was our market, the specialty business. We're now in a 45,000 square foot building. We specialize in close tolerance. Our precision sheet has the closest tolerances of any sheet in the world. Name your color, name your hardness, name your shape. We make things softer than most cast urethane companies want to deal with. Every day we're pouring products in virtually every durometer, any color you'd ever think of. Uh, and we're running these simultaneously. And it's, it's like a juggler trying to keep 12 balls in the air at the same time. And we're really, really very good at it.